Yes. Oh, oh, we, there we go. <laughs> quite a start to the segment. We are welcomed back by Debbie Dukeman, who you have been on the show before. You're known as the rat lady around yes. here. And that's Mickey, who yep. just did a wonderful jump. Which, now, Mickey, which, came, Mickey came last time you were on the show. That's right. So, uh, this yep. is the sequel. Would you like to see him jump again? Oh, I would love it. <laughs> now, this is, you've been, you've, uh -oh. you've had, you've been involved with rats for how long? Come on, Mickey. I've been the rat lady for almost 20 years. Come on, Mickey, jump. Yay. Yay. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> and how, why rats? What, how did it begin? Um, it began when I took a job at Chico State taking care of the rats in the psychology department. And um, I fell in love with them all over again because I actually did have them as pets when I was a kid. So I just uh, started answering people's questions about them and wrote a book about them. And now I'm the rat lady. W would you call rat? Hello. <laughs> It's nice to see you. Uh, would you call rats intelligent? Yes. I would say that the uh, smartest rats are smarter than the dumbest dogs. So their intelligence level crosses over with dogs. Mm -hmm. And how did you even get to teaching, I mean, tricks? What, what brought about the tricks? Well, I wanted to show people how um, rats are responsive and um, are willing to do things for you. Uh, Mickey loves jumping, mm -hmm. and, and it's not just, I, I didn't give him a treat for doing that, you know? Mm -hmm. He just did it because it's fun. And we need to explain that, that these aren't sewer rats. These, <laughs> these are, what kind of? Domestic rats. Domestic rats. Are you, Hello, are Mickey. you a little nervous about these guys coming uh, over and visiting you? Not at all. <laughs> not so at all. It's just here. not every day. It's not every day that you get flirted with a rat. No. Um, Usually I have dogs licking my face. No, thank you. <laughs> and, before you were going to answer that, go ahead. Yeah, these are domestic rats. They've been bred in captivity for, for many, many generations to be selected to be particularly docile and, and gentle. What would you say to the people at home right now that are saying, this woman has rats crawling all over her body and I am terrified? Well, it, I think um, most people have a, a, a bad uh, image of rats because they've learned it from TV and movies. And rats really are not like that. If they had a chance to really um, get to know them, I think they'd find that they're a lot like dogs. And this is a really extreme hobby, which is, I mean, it, it really is extreme. I mean, yes. you must admit. And now on the John Wall Show, as you're going to be appearing today, mm -hmm. you've already been there and taped a segment yes. where they talk about extreme hobbies. And you're featured, and you've, I mean, nationally been picked up a lot. Yes, I've been on, this will be my seventh national show so far. So um, rats are getting real popular these days. And how did the They're show They're all the fad. Yeah. Yes, they are. It's a cool thing to do. Um, they found out about me on the Ripley's Believe It or Not website, and I was on that show last year. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I, I mean, I, I guess for you, the purpose is really to get the education out there. That's right. I want people to know that rats are real friendly and, and not scary. And I wonder if Mickey can do one last jump for us. All right. Thank you. I think he might. And what's the other rat's name? Yeah, we've left out the oh, other rat. Oh, yes. This is Soda, and Soda is a Siamese rat. And I also took him to the John Walsh show, but he didn't want to do his trick. He, he, he's uh, got stage fright. Okay. Oh, oh here, there he goes. Oh, he did it by himself. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Any other tricks that, that the rats can do? Well, Soda can do a trick where he pulls. Soda can. That was funny. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was good. <laughs> Uh, he can do a trick where he pulls up a little basket on a string, but uh, he only likes to do it at home. He, like I said, he's a little, a little, a little, a little camera uh, shy. Well, yeah, we yeah. thank you so much for coming and bringing them back, and it'll be interesting to see tonight uh, or today at two o'clock on the John Wall Show. It, sh it should be fun. I, I tried to get John to kiss one of the rats, but he wouldn't do it. Oh. But but he did pet a hairless rat. Oh really? Mm -hmm. Do we want to ask Rob Blair to kiss one? <laughs> no, I think we no, have his answer. No, but I think he already pet. You already pet. He did, and I think we're going to leave before we get in any more trouble. <laughs> I didn't kiss it. I just looked at it in the eyes. It was real close. Thanks again for coming, Debbie. <laughs> Thank you. Stay with us. We'll be right back.